Hello everyone, and welcome to another Perfect English YouTube video. Today, we're going to be reading a story called A Bug's Life. Now, A Bug's Life is a level 3 reader, so this is the biggest one that we've done so far. And that means that to keep the size of the video down, I'm going to be focusing mainly on actually reading the story instead of uh, asking questions about it. And then in another video, maybe I'll come back next week with a few questions about the story, okay? But we want to keep the video length down, so this is how we're going to try it out this time. All right, so the story is called A Bug's Life. On the cover, you can see three characters. You can see a purple bug, a green bug, and a blue bug. Let's find out more about them. This is Flick. He is kind and very funny. He tries to help, but he makes a lot of mistakes. Look! The food is falling. Oh no, Flick, now there is no food for the grasshoppers. Grasshoppers arrive and they are very angry because there is no food for them. The ants are scared. They cannot fight the grasshoppers. The grasshoppers are bigger and stronger than the ants. Where's the food? What did you do? It was an accident. are also angry because Flick always makes mistakes. Now they have to find more food. But Flick has an idea. He can go to the city and he can find bigger bugs. The bigger bugs can help them. The bigger bugs can fight the grasshoppers. The ants do not like Flick's idea. They think it is a big mistake, but they let him go. Flick arrives in the city, and he is excited. There are a lot of big, strong bugs. Perhaps they can help Flick with the problem on Ant Island. He meets some circus bugs. They are loud and fun and big. The circus bugs can fight the grasshoppers. Flick invites them to Ant Island. The circus bugs want to leave quickly for Ant Island. They do not understand Flick's dangerous idea. They want to perform for the ants and the grasshoppers. Oh, ow, ow, ow. You're perfect! Oh, great ones! I have been scouting for bugs with your exact talents! Oh, a talent scout! Colony's in trouble! Grasshoppers are coming! We've been forced to prepare all this food! Genius here, Jeff! Food? Please! Will you help us? Ooh, where are they? We'll take the job! Yeah, really? No, no, no. Yes! On Ant Island, the ants are working all day and all night. They have to find more food for the grasshoppers because of Flick's mistake. It is very difficult, and they are tired. Then suddenly, the ants see Flick with the circus bugs. So, you see, it was my fault the hoppers coming back, but then Princess Ada... The circus bugs are funny. But they are also big and strong. Perhaps Flick is right and the circus bugs can help. The ants meet the circus bugs and welcome them to Ant Island. The 
and children have a present for the circus bugs. It is a big picture. It shows the circus bugs with the grasshoppers. They are fighting. Suddenly, the circus bugs understand what the ants want. They are scared. They do not want to fight the grasshoppers. They want to perform for them. Then Flick has an idea. He speaks to the circus bugs and the ants. What are grasshoppers afraid of? Grasshoppers hate birds. Flick wants to make a bird, a very big bird. The bird can scare the grasshoppers. The circus bugs and the ants are excited now because they do not have to fight. Together they make a big, beautiful bird. Flick climbs inside the bird and flies it. He smiles. The bird is great, but can it fool the grasshoppers? The grasshoppers come back to Ant Island. They are angry and they want food. No, I'm wrong. You're lower than dirt. You're an ant. Let this be a lesson to all you ants. Ideas are very dangerous things. You are mindless, soil-shoving losers. Put on this earth to serve us. But the ants want to show the grasshoppers their circus first. The grasshoppers sit and watch the circus bugs. The circus bugs are funny. They sing and jump and throw balls. The grasshoppers like the circus. Flick quietly climbs inside the bird. The bird starts to fly up, then it falls. Oh, the pain! There goes my magic axe! Flaming! Yes! No, PT! Down, down. The grasshoppers are very scared. Then the bird falls through the sky. Crash! Flick climbs out. Now the grasshoppers understand Flick's plan. The bird is not real. They are very angry. Flick looks at the circus bugs and the ants. They are small, but together they are big and strong. Together they can fight the grasshoppers. The grasshoppers are surprised that the ants want to fight back. Suddenly, the grasshoppers look up. There is a big, hungry bird in the sky. It is real. It is looking at them, and it is coming closer. The grasshoppers run away from Ant Island very quickly. The ants clap to say thank you to the circus bugs. The circus bugs go back to the city. The ants are happy now. A bug's life does not have to be difficult. Alright, let's take a look at some of the words that appear in the story, okay? One of the words is circus. The circus bugs, okay? Circus is a place where a lot of people will perform. They will do tricks and they will jump around, jump through fiery rings, and do lots of other exciting things. Okay? We also have grasshoppers. Grasshoppers are kind of a long kind of bug. Usually they're green and they can make an interesting sound at night. We call that sound chirping. They're related to crickets. Okay? We also have the word fight. Fight. This is a word that comes up multiple times in this story because it's something that at first nobody wants to do. Nobody wants to fight. Okay? But in the end, it almost looks like they have to fight until a bird helps them. Another word is climbs. Climbs. Use your arms and legs to go up something. And the last word is scare. Scare. Scare means to make someone feel afraid. They're scared of the grasshoppers.
all right. Those are just a few vocabulary words that, if you can understand them, might make it easier for you to understand the story. Please watch this video more than once. Come back to it when you have a chance. And then when we post the question and answer video, maybe it'll be easy for you to follow along. Have a wonderful day. Bye-bye.